Welcome to the World Herald News for the 5th of May 2024. Holy Spirit, show us what we need to hear in spiritual news today. Justice, number 8. And the Seven of Swords. Somebody is trying to get away from the long arm of the law. Look at that. They're wearing a mask. Somebody's an actor or an actress. Somebody is afraid to tell the truth, but the truth will be revealed about some women and a man, or this is God himself revealing these women, exposing them. The 14th of May is here, so something will be happening mid-May. Seven of Cups. Somebody is trying to create the illusion that a person is dying. This is connected to what I was saying yesterday about the doctors trying to trick a person into thinking that they're dying, but it's an illusion. I'm getting more messages about this. And actually, even yesterday I got more messages after I stopped recording that video I posted. There's a woman who's sick and the doctors want to take an organ from another woman. They want to trick the other woman into thinking that she's sick and the organ needs to be removed. But the organ is very healthy and that's exactly why they want to take it and put it into a woman who is actually sick. Because that woman is an elite. Yes. They're taking the organs from the plebs and putting them into the elites. I've been getting messages like this for a very long time. That's what they're planning to do. There could be a blonde man and a woman with brown hair. Four of Wands reversed. There could be some kind of separation here with a Four of Wands reversed. Somebody is not very happy in their home life, in their family life. Six of Pentacles. Somebody's begging for help. Six of Swords. They're ready to travel anywhere to fix something. The 19th of June could be significant. Somebody could be planning to travel somewhere on the 19th of June. Judgment 20. So somebody's suffering very badly right now because they're under judgment. So this person is sick because that is their karma. The years 2019 and 2020 could be significant. There could be a female who's getting karma because of things she did in 2019 and 2020 possibly. Four of Cups. Somebody is rejecting God's will. Eight of Cups. Somebody's turned their back on God. They've gone to the dark side completely. That's why they're under judgment. I just saw free, free, free. These could be Freemasons, yes. <sighs> King of Swords. There could be a male air sign who's totally turned to the dark side. Seven of Cups, 87. Somebody be born in 87 or something happened in 87. Five of Pentacles, somebody could have turned their back on God since 1987 even. Or somebody born in 1987 has turned their back on God, however this goes. So they have very few chances left, very little time left to repent. These sick people who are trying to steal organs instead of praying to God. The Queen of Wands. Could be a female in particular. She could be married. Maybe she wore a dress like this at the wedding. She might have long brown hair. She might be very thin. She might want to steal somebody else's uterus. Yes. From a universal donor, from somebody who has zero positive blood, right? Somebody of her own race. 
the fool. Aries energy. She might even be trying to take organs from a child. Wow. Or a much younger woman. <sighs> Queen of Swords. Ten of Pentacles. I mean, death. Somebody's family member, somebody's wife is about to die. The 13th of October could be significant. Maybe they're trying to steal an organ from somebody born on the 13th of October, a Libra possibly, or a Scorpio, or an earth sign. Or this person is sick. Ten of Pentacles keeps coming out. Yeah, look, the 13th of October keeps coming out. King of Wands. There's definitely a blonde man here. He's completely possessed. Hmm. Or somebody who looks Northern European. Nine of Pentacles, the High Priestess. Two of Cups. There's a couple here who's trying to get organs from other people to put them in themselves. Eight of Pentacles, that's what they're working on, yeah? And they have doctors working on it for them too. The moon, 18. Look, 818 is here again. Something about this number, 818. An address, the 18th of August, Leo season, however this goes. The page of wands. Somebody keeps trying to steal organs from much younger people. That's what I'm getting here. So, some young people could be getting bad news from the doctor that they're sick. We need to remove your organ. And then the organ goes to some elites. And all of a sudden, they're um, miraculously cured. Queen of Swords. Yes, exactly. The Tower, 16. So, there could be some kind of tower moment where a person is being told that they're dying of cancer or whatever else they're dying of. They're taking the organ and giving them to somebody who actually has it. There we go. Who are the people being targeted? Let's clarify. Who are the people being targeted for their organs? Let's clarify so they know if they're watching. Four of Cups, somebody who doesn't see this coming. Could be a water sign. Could be a 42-year-old water sign, possibly. Somebody could have the name of a flower. This could be a female with the name of a flower, possibly. Three of Pentacles. Could be three different people. There could be three different candidates. Somebody's trying to take organs from all these people. So like I said before, somebody's Frankenstein's monster. They've got organs from everywhere. So they can live forever or however this goes. Somebody be born in March. They could be 42. So this could be a Pisces specifically. One of the people. Ten of Pentacles. Somebody could be trying to get organs from their own family member. With a Ten of Pentacles. Or a whole family could be targeted. People could be trying to get organs from free members of the same family, possibly. Or, if this is a cult or a coven, they could be taking organs from members of the cult or coven. If they can't take it from somebody else. Five of Wands reversed. Somebody's losing a battle here. So this could be either a cult-like family or a cult of some sort. And they've been trying to sacrifice people to take their organs for themselves or for their masters. If they cannot sacrifice anyone to take their organs, then they will be sacrificed themselves, basically. That's what I'm getting here. And their organs will be harvested. Show me some people because it's not really showing me people. I said show me people, but I feel like these are members of the cult, coven, or family who are losing battles here. RB. The initials RB could be significant. 
or just R or B. Could be two different people. The Emperor. This could be an Aries man with the initials RB possibly. It doesn't have to be. Three of Swords. This could be somebody's father. Could definitely be a fire sign. Aries or Leo. The Empress, number three. The 18th of March, Pisces season. Libra, Taurus could be significant. Six of Wands. Ten of Pentacles, the 6th of October. You know what happened on the 6th of October? That's when their war started. The Chariot. 47 or 74 could be significant. Somebody could be a cardinal sign. These are people in positions of power and authority. Somebody could be an Aries, somebody could be a Cancer, Libra, Taurus, Capricorn, possibly Leo too. Somebody could be on the cusp of a fire sign and an earth sign. Four of Pentacles, 34 or 43 could be significant, 41 could be significant, somebody could be an earth sign. They could be 41, Three of Swords, and the Knight of Cups. Somebody is heartbroken. It could be that um, somebody's husband is heartbroken because the wife is sick. And he's trying anything he can to save the wife, possibly. But again with the flower here. There's a female flower here. The flower is about to lose her flower. Uh-oh, judgment. So they're about to sacrifice a woman with the name of a flower to take her organ and give it to somebody else. Eight of Wands. Strength. Somebody could be a Leo. Uh-oh. 21, the world. It's over. This will be happening during the summer solstice, most likely. Yes, exactly. This year, 21st of January, that's when the year of the Chinese dragon started. So this year, 15, something could be happening on the 15th of a month. The Wheel of Fortune, the Ace of Wands, the High Priestess. Ten of Cups, Ten of Swords, the Hermit, yes, they're going to sacrifice one of their own family members or somebody's family or a whole family or members of the same cult. Two of Wands, Twelve or Twenty-One could be significant, Eleven, Twelve. Somebody could be Eleven and turning Twelve. They could be trying to sacrifice a child. Or somebody's born on the 11th or the 12th in November or December. The Magician, one. And the Star, 17. The 17th of January could be significant Capricorn season. Hmm. Hmm. This could be two men, an Earth sign and an Air sign. Nine of Pentacles. Somebody could be a Virgo. The Page of Pentacles. They could be sacrificing a Virgo who's a part of this group or coven. Nine of Pentacles. Yes, there's a Virgo here. Queen of Pentacles. So the Virgo is going to be sacrificed. This is somebody who is a part of the coven. They're wearing a mask. Four of Swords. Uh-oh. So she's going to be the main character being sacrificed here. Absolutely. Yep. Yeah. This is a member of the coven. They're going to take her organ. A woman with brown hair will be taking an organ from another woman with brown hair. Nine of swords. Anxiety. She's afraid of this. Nine nine could be significant. The year 1999. The 9th of September. Again, Virgo season. Somebody's a Virgo. 
They're part of this cult and they will be sacrificed by their bosses. Yep. That's what I'm getting here. And it's not this Virgo because I'm not a part of any coven. Although I was on the list, wasn't I? For the organ. Page of Cups. Seven of Pentacles. Pocket Watcher. A pocket watcher. This is somebody who watches my channel who's going to be sacrificed instead. 